Say the line, Bart. Last time on uh, Elden, Elden Ring. Ring. Hey! <laughs> uh, what do you have for us? Well, oh, I was looking at the map, and the map was generous enough to straight up just tell me where a buck is, where my friend was. That was cool. As if we were supposed to know. As if we were supposed to know, <laughs> and this time we didn't have to sit. Bok the seamster, at your service, master. Ready to make adjustments to your goals. <coughs> he moved to the East Rail Carrier Gate. Well then, and did you get some some garment altered? Or? Uh, I so I did have altered garments, but not any that I that I oh, going so soon. did with him. Please do be safe on your journeys. But it seems as if there was a, uh, you know, that's all he had to say really. Not not much. Um, he moved up there, okay. so I'm gonna keep a note of that. He's gone northward, right? We met him down by the the storm gate. Yeah. Then he moved up to. Well, he went to the to the coastal cave, and then he moved up to the tip of Lyrnia, and then uh, he moved up again. Yeah. Okay. And. Uh, yeah, yes, uh, just before that reminder right there that popped up. Altered garments change descriptions in some cases. Uh, and I did notice that I picked up some things pre-altered. So I have equipment that is altered that uh, dropped that way. Okay. So... Um, oh, it can drop altered or unaltered. Yeah, I've picked up three things I can think of in altered states. Which I wonder is just like an even lower percentage, you know? If it's like a 0.01% or some shit. But like, um, I picked up like an altered version of the smoke armor, the fat armor I, I have. Okay. Uh, I picked up, yeah, like one or two other things in an altered state. And uh, yes, some of them actually have changed descriptions. Um, and slight adjustments to the numbers. Very slight, but you know, the cape removal might actually lead to more um, mm. lore on, the, on this, the description. So it's important to check that stuff. Cool. Uh, cool. Yep. Yeah, so we're gonna check that out. All right, Buck. Thank you for your services. What's going on here? Aha! <laughs> Aha! So yeah, this motherfucker is impossible. <laughs> going to the blood bank. <laughs> but uh, just like, okay, what can we? What can we see? What can we? What can we do? What can we learn? And at the very least, how much of this matchup can I understand before I'm ready? You know? You understand that. Uh -huh, uh -huh. You gotta see it. You gotta know the gaps. See the frames. It, it doesn't hurt to lab a little early, right? And besides, like if I get to if I get some time on my own, it's a it's a it's a goal. It's a straightforward goal, as opposed to, you know, horse side wandering. Yeah. So, you know. All right, finding the gaps under the armpit. You got that first phase under control, though. Like you are, you already you I understand. I, I, I feel like I, I, yeah. I feel like I kind of did, though it was uh, a lot of get the fuck away from me play. <laughs> you know what I mean? And yes, definitely a. I thought every time you're standing within Moonville, Moonville range, you know, <laughs> talking a lot of shit for someone within Moonville range. It's in the box. The will, box will it's quiver. In the box. Let the box shake violently. <laughs> Upside down, still locked. <laughs> the call. Of the, the burning on the back of my neck. Uh, uh, uh. Freeze. A bit too far. Come on, I want him to count. But you can see with each touch, it's like you're 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 basically working down chip damage hmm? at this point, right? Car counter. <laughs> Pop. Make it rain. All right. Yeah, admittedly, if Moonvale post nerf is not what it used to be, I'm st I, I only know the the one in my life that I've seen. <laughs> to be perfectly honest, and even then, 
Even then, it's still crazy. It was. Da, da, da. God, this song is burnt in, dude. Yeah. Da, must have heard it a lot. Da, da. <laughs> Put it as your ringtone. Oh boy. Okay, okay, patience. It's a... It, it was a very patient way. That's gonna get in range. Oh! Uh oh. Oh! Nihil! 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 All right, how are your sips? What's going on now? Bro leg! Bro leg, we need a distraction. He doesn't care. Oh watch, boy. watch bro leg melt. Let's go. Oh my god. Okay, he came for you. Came for me. Damn. You can you can play Toro Toro. Jeez. And then the arena is a fuck, as you remember. Yep. Uh-huh. Hiding behind the graves, blood loss. No more flasks. There's no way. Later, Oleg. There's no way. <laughs> How are you gonna do this? There's no way. Oh boy. <laughs> Everywhere. Oh, dude, I, is lava. Look, I mean, is there a reason to stop labbing? How much blue do you have left? Oh my god. <sighs> what a dodge. Okay. I'm like, yeah, that healing that he does, proper bringing him back to 75%, uh -huh. you know. Hold that. <laughs> you have to beat 1.5 of him. So that ground stab, that ground stab, that can that be done, you up. it can be done at any point in the string. And when it comes out, like... Fuck your defensive options. It's an interrupter. You know, it's a hard call out. Dude, there's no way. So let's try other things. Okay. I will. This is just again. It's fucking. It ain't for now, right? This is clearly not yep, for now. Yeah, yeah. But, but we're the testing but the evolution of the matchup. All right. Can I show you the evolution of the matchup a little bit, just to show you what I learned? Is that okay? Okay. Okay. Two hands, bloodhound step. Shmovement. Okay. Dude. We're a little too early. But can we make it look cool you while step we step in? While we live. Dude, you step in. Can we make it look cool for a minute, man? <laughs> Even though it's futile. Dude, it looks really good. It looks pretty good. <laughs> I don't know, man. He's kind of melting. <laughs> Dude, can we work it for a minute? Can we work it for a You're minute? You're taking his ribs. And then what? Oh my god. The jet engine is slowly starting to... Slowly turning <laughs> on. <laughs> it's not on yet! The jet engine is not on yet! But like, you're hearing the fan starting to turn! Alright. Let's get an archer in. Because Oleg melts. Ancestral follower. Let's get someone who can shoot arrows. Oh, he got tagged, he got tagged. Right through. Are you actually gonna do it? Oh, 
Those guys stepping? Reggie, I told you, we're just lapping. <laughs> Yo! Get his attention. A little bit more survivability. Not a ton. Ooh, fuck. Oh my god, okay. And now he's back. Got all of my attention. Oh, it's everywhere. <laughs> wow. Okay. When to drink, when to drink. Oh my god. Impaled. Michaela is mine, and mine alone. Back turn. <laughs> Shoosh. <laughs> Skewered. Skewered. So just... Can we learn? <laughs> can we... What can, can we learn more about phase two? Since phase one... Is we can move it, uh -huh. but can we? But that phase two, let's change the robes up. Last time that was a little bit of blood resistance. Okay. This time a little bit of fire resistance because fire is everywhere. And is that a rock sling? And you know what? Fuck a shield. We're we're doing the no shield build. Punch now. mage is punch mage. Now we're committing. We're switching back to the meteoric staff. We got rock sling on. We want some crumples if we can get them. People like that rock sling. It's pretty solid. While we work the ribs, while we work the body. Yo, cold blooded. And you keep it in the left hand so that you can keep the movement. Cold blooded. But you gotta work. <laughs> Again, I just want to know the limits. I know how it ends, <laughs> but I want to know. Jab, hook, uppercut. Yo, that's a really good skill. Feel it when my punch is up in your gut. Yo, that step is really good. Oh, here we go. Switching up the physique. Going for different punch improvers, magic improvers, healing, trying every physique we've got. Ori. Sniper. Right. Good tank. All I want is survivability and some sniping. Don't get up close. Ooh. That hurt. That hurt her. Boom. Punch mage. All right. Cast over Sling here. In. <laughs> oh, there's the armpit. Uh oh. What a dodge. The step is too good. We have the step and the cast in the opposite hand. So we got punch on one hand, cast in the other, and the skates on. The step is so good. If you know when. Oh no, Ori! Just get try to get those rock crumples. Come on, come on, come on! <laughs> She's hanging in there. No way! But I'm not. No way! The evolution <laughs> of the matchup. That's all. Just seeing ideas. Just seeing ideas. And look at that. Still in it. Still in it. Still surviving. So you know. There's just yeah. <laughs> Another try. You know. Just the different ideas and how well they last. Damn. That blood bank is uh it's like please don't come back, sir. Give yourself twenty four hours. At least. Yo. Yo. Wow. <laughs> Get down. Mm. Big damage. Oh, 
Ouch. And then the pup. Get him on the far side. Four. Three. Every knee heal steals your life. Three sips. 75%. Damn. Mog Swift with some bad blood. Oh, not swift enough, Wooly. T Swifty showing you how it works. Uh uh, in there. New strategy. Uh uh. The only uh. summon is my left and my right. <laughs> We good, we good. Step in, step in. Keep close, you gotta duck, you gotta duck in. Roll. Woof. Counter. Not bad. This looks like a good run. <sighs> the wings. Yo, footwork, footwork, yep. boxers, twist. Keep your range, keep your range. Step. Like Mike Tyson, you know, moving on the side, getting the ribs. Get that rotation. <laughs> Oh no. Always scary, always scary. Footwork takes FP. Oh, sorry. Okay. Make your brain. Under 50 left. Out. Nice, nice. Nice footwork. Find the rhythm. Stay on the ropes, stay on the ropes. Wooly, boobaye, wooly, boobaye. Get that back on the ropes. Damn, damn, okay. A bit of blue. Not yet, not yet. Whoa. Wondrous Physic for the slight heal. Over time. Okay, I see it, I see it. God. Yo. You're dancing. <laughs> Round eight. <laughs> <gasps> you see, yes, he, he, he can bleed, man. You can get him, he's not a machine. Okay, okay, okay. You're so close, dude. Don't break my heart again. Don't break my heart. We step in, we step in. <laughs> dude? 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 Chill. Yo! Yo! <laughs> it's time, right? We got this! <laughs> no, ah, red, stop! You in there? Uh -uh. Okay, patience! Yeah, that step is so good! That step is so good! Blood curdling! It's over, right? <laughs> no way. No way. No way. You good. You good. Can I talk my shit oh again? Oh my god. <gasps> Mogwin. 
Can I talk my shit again? You may. You may. Yo, I was afraid. <laughs> I was Let afraid. me talk my shit. <laughs> With the fists of fury? Okay, not bad. Not bad. Yeah, take, take the pause. Take the pause. <laughs> take the pause. <laughs> Popping alone in his living room. Like, yes! <laughs> Gonna make it look good. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not supposed to happen. <laughs> I can feel it. And here's how you know it's not supposed to happen. Look at the runes. Oh my god. Did that say 420,000? Look at those runes. This is not supposed to happen. <laughs> 420k. Blaze yo, it. Yo, light it up. Light it up. Light it up. All up in your blood. You okay, man. Drinking, smoking, straight West Coast and pussy popping, sex promoting. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah, you weren't supposed to be there. I don't think so. All right. Okay, that's good. <laughs> All right. Two hands. Two hands. Two hands. No magic. <laughs> no assists. Bloodhound step. Yo, it's it's so good. We move. Shh, move it. So, for the record, for the curious. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh yeah, that, that's a while. That's that, that's a while. That's oh my that's, god, that's, that's a few hours. That's reality. <laughs> All right. Ride. The struggle. Get back on your horse. We'll Ride. <laughs> Ride. Get back on. Let's go. Horse. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What's next? What is next, what Reggie? What is next? The world is yours. What is your your oyster? Just like this thing over here. Cocoon of the Empyrean. The cocoon. Um, yeah. That was... I'm feeling pretty good about that. That feels earned. <laughs> that was a lot. Punching above but, your pay grade. <laughs> Still did it. But, uh, you know, the fighting game mentality and or normal mentality of, like, correct your mistakes each step, no matter how slight, still works. Yeah, it's possible. Still works. I can do it. Punch Mom was like, dude, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> and like, my answer is this. getting there. <laughs> It's like, I got this. It's not supposed to happen. I'm like, I know, but I'm getting there. Okay. So the result of that uh, is a couple things. One, um, okay. How does that compare to fume um, is, is, is a question. Uh, that was more. That took more out of me. Um, Damn. The legendary... All, like two hour, you know, uh, fight that that took me forever in 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 uh, DS two. Uh, this beats that easily. Uh, this was way more than two hours, way more. Uh, this was the hardest thing I've I've accomplished in any of these games. Oh shit! Okay. Uh, with the build. Why? Because of the build. With this, what and, and with with what I had and with the. Um, amount of mistakes I was allowed to make plus the sip stealing and everything um, so uh, yeah you know and, and even then it's like you're mitigating with the flame drip ever so slightly um, Actually, uh, it looks kind of cool yeah yeah and I'm now spiritually connected to some degree yeah history <laughs> with it to some degree uh, no point in eating those those, those blood things um, for what it's worth you know trying out a, a couple different summons 
uh, Ori sustains, man. Ori sustains and she'll snipe. Like, I, I, I have nothing but respect for that. Um, enemies yeah. with, like, uh, an AoE, like, fucking just, like, Broleg is just standing in the fire and bleeding and dying, you know? So, um, anyway, what do I, I want to put my lantern on. Um, yeah, and then the other thing, of course, was Roxling getting back on the on the list was important because uh, we didn't really see it there, but sustained Roxlings, especially with the, I guess with the the gravity staff, the meteorite staff, you get some crumples off of that man. Pop, 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 like it, it, they count as hits, you know. Mm. Um, so that shit's cool too, and fire resistance talisman um, is a is a champion right there. I'm thinking I'm gonna yeah, gonna go back for my equip load. Yeah. Um The other champion was this. Remember? Oh the combo. The combo talisman. Okay. Successive attacks. Pop 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 pop. Right? That's really good. The five hit yeah. string meant more when I have this on and you're doing your frost and blood build up, right? So the combo talisman and, of course, the source seal stayed on. So uh, I still had a little bit more squishiness to me while I was doing it. Um, so that was what I was wearing, which is with, with a little bit of fire resistance here and there, you know? Mm -hmm. um, yeah. So that's, that's a, I guess, a little bit of a... Wow, you evolved. A little bit of a, a heads up. So what's going on? Definitely had to, had to learn... A whole new, a whole new bag of tricks uh, on that. Uh, so let me get my friends in. Um, okay. And yeah, the shield came off, and we were just casting over here with this, and that that was that was what it was. Uh, and you know what? Depending on whether or not I'm allowed to, so I'm still heavy for that, right? Yeah. Okay. So, if I, like, if I can get all three, okay, maybe we can just wear something slightly lighter. Uh, oh, did I pick the wrong talisman? Okay, but it's still heavy. Uh, <laughs> do these stack up? Will it? No, 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 can't. Okay. No both. Possible. No both. Okay. Oh, that would be too much, I guess. All right. Well, okay. fine. Fine. That's fair. Um, so I had that. I had that. And then that was, yeah, combos are good. And combos are good is, is, is good for the build I have. All right. We can just lighten up in some other way then. Uh, if we want to just have the option to pull a, a potential shield out. Uh, Eric Sorcerer. That's a possibility there. That gives us our mid. And we have fire resistance over there as well. Can I get the poise from using uh where are they? Here they are. Nope, that takes me straight to heavy. Okay. Uh, oh. All right. Well, anyway, this might not matter in a second because we have 4.2 hundred thousand to use. Um, so Let's level up. Yeah. <laughs> so much money. 420k. I, like, nothing, nothing confirmed the insanity of what I was trying to do. Like, seeing that number pop up and go, oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. Got it. And then, of course, we have the stuff that he dropped. So, yeah. Um, so, where do you want to put it? Get five. Wait, hold on, hold on. How many levels are we, do we have here? Yeah, hold on a second. Five levels. Jeez. We have five levels to use. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, int is 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 very relevant. Int is our build. Uh, if we hit fifty two, we can switch to uh, different staffs. We can create different, cast different sorceries, um, and our punch is still. Are affected by this ever so slightly. We can also uh, 
possibly equip different things, but we're going, uh, we're going, uh, we're trying to hit that 60. We want to get those good spells, you know? Mm. Um, <laughs> 60. That's crazy. That's, 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 that, that's how I feel about it. Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know. Do you have any thoughts? Intelligence for the good things. Strength. You have a few weapons that are interesting with strength as well, right? Mm-hmm. Um, are you okay with 40 Vigor? I mean, for now. Yeah, so strength and intelligence seems to be the play. There's nothing else there that we want to improve upon. And all the things we want to wear is strength or intelligence. So I think that's a good mix. Okay. Cool shit comes from getting intelligence all the way up yeah and it still makes the punch go hard either way it just it just cares more about the uh it cares more about the strength but yeah let's try to hit 60 as soon as we can to see that that renala stuff you okay. know spend 418,000 runes <laughs> and now i got a dollar in my pocket 11 bucks cool <sighs> Yeah, so... You changed, Woody. Look at you. Oh my god, that's so fucking cool. <laughs> What's this about? What's going on? Hello? Not gonna grab me and pull me into the DLC? <laughs> no? Can I kiss the ring? It's right at the right not. height. Alright. Well, let's explore the area then. Mikella was yours. Rotten. But not anymore, perhaps. Visions of behind. Let's get a better look at that. That crack. I'm surprised that... There's no interact prompt yeah. upon walking up to this. Can't take the ring, you can't like... Yeah. You know, take Michaela's blood or something. Yeah, I, I kind of half expected that to happen. Um, so... Yeah. All right, DLC. <laughs> they probably have plans for DLCs, right? I would assume so. I mean, it's such a common Ooh. expectation that's nice mm -hmm. that's not cron and we're above and look at that you can start to see like nebula yeah formations even hmm okay buy some pajamas with that nebula That'll look good and so we never actually um, looked at the area, mind you, behind the, the gateway to this place. So, you know, there definitely yeah, was behind the gateway. zone. You know, there's all this zone over here, yeah. which is probably comparable to, uh, to the action that we've, we've faced here. So um, that's there. We were in the middle of crawling through Incel. Yeah. A little bit as well. <laughs> right? Just getting it, checking it off the uh -huh. list. And then the plateau still awaits. Right? There's still a lot of plateau action. Yeah. That piece of map. So. Um, so much to uncover. So still. much to uncover. So much to uncover. But uh, let's uh, let's make our way through Incel. At which point do we go into space? <laughs> I mean, we've already been. <laughs> as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> I Some right, right around the time the fucking uh, the comet dropped, you know. Here we are. All right, so yeah, we have honestly, it's pretty open right now. To be perfectly honest. Oh, oh. yeah, with a giant shooter. Yep. Possibilities are <laughs> very open for us. Oh, 
Okay, so based on the map, there was an opening. Oh, huh. an opening, you say? Well, it looked like there was. I'm not sure. Let's get around and, and see them. Oh, double spear. Clay men don't give a damn. Man, that's smooth. Dash, dash, jump R2, dash, dash. So if we just hide for a little bit. Can't pull up the map from here while we're ac activated, though. Um, there we are. Looks like there's something, you know, possibly uh -huh. in this pathway. Like path. Which is upstairs, if anything. Ta 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 ta. How do we get upstairs again? Uh oh. Oh. Oh, three spearmen, okay. I was wondering what that was. They were just crouching, yeah, that was yeah. a bit weird. <gasps> Ooh. I'm surprised that didn't hit you more than that. Okay. And then the shop was uh -huh. back there. Is there something in the shop? No, but if I could just de-aggro his... Well, divorce from one's trade does not come easily. Uh, if I can just de-aggro him for a second. There we go. Yeah, okay. Alright, maybe we can't access it from there. In which case... It would be all the way around this way, okay. and then going, you know, the long way. This might be a top to bottom thing, like down the waterfall. So should we teleport to the other grace, or...? Uh, I'm just gonna... Double check? Double check right over here, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's from the top of the waterfall. Yeah, that's that's what that's what they're showing us. So, like that opening over here, uh huh, is if he deagros. I mean, there's a fucker up there. Yes. Yeah. So we're looking at essentially like. You know, the ability to walk this way and drop down this way, but not the ability to go up. Okay. So then, uh, let's go this way, and then come around the long way. And then we can explore that little narrow path. I think that makes sense. Uh, How far is this? Can you walk across this, actually? Uh, just up ahead on the left? Oh, 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 oh. Yes! I think so. Yeah, okay. Oh, but it doesn't reach, though. Right? Items up there, items over there. Oh, hold on. Maybe we can make it. By crossing onto that side. Oh. Item? Maybe? 
Ouch, 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 ouch. Oh, doesn't no. seem like it, nah. It's a lot of action here. Whoa. Feels like you almost could, you know? <laughs> yeah. Alright. Gotta wait for it. All right. Yeah, it's gonna it's gonna take a bit to find that area. Let's hope this works. Yeah, and if there was a way up from there, then like I'll go back and look. But uh, for now, this looks like you can do a roundabout path. So. Uh, let's take it. Yeah. I, I might change my look again, to be honest, though. Like, yeah, you missed the old one? I, you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, That's uh, fair. That's a style. Fashion ring. You hold enemy up. Mm-hmm. The spider, right? Yeah. Right. This was blocked off. Right, right, right. Oh, yeah. Right, okay. That was... Ah, shit. Well, I guess this is the way. It has to be through here. <laughs> um, how about going around and coming back over that way? Oh, well, maybe. Mayhaps. Wait, we were in this room. This had no exits. But... That was... The far side. That was the seat. Um... Yeah. Okay, so like... Just before it... Alright, here. Well, this seems pretty walled off. Yeah. yeah, well, let's 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 just look around again. Now that we have the map, we can follow anything that looks like an opening. But sometimes the arm, sometimes the map, like, looks like an opening, but it's not. Mm. I'm not gonna call it a lie, but maybe an untruth. Oh yeah, the creepy bodies. Right. So. This was a drop. Yeah. That was a don't you dare, I think. That was a don't you dare. And... That's the edge. This was all solid. And this was all drop. But you, you think like, oh, maybe I could scoot around there somehow. But, uh... Now that was all lethal. Yeah, we're just we're we're pl we're basically like we're being we have a, it's a, we're playing a map game uh -huh. right now. Uh, the heck is this? Ah, oh, tranquility. Nope. Man. All right. Well. Um. Did I just scrape not good enough in that in the in the room with the with the the rocks? Like this. 
this direction is nothing. It's just structure. It's not actually pathway. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Hermit merchant, and then... Maybe behind the merchants? Yeah, over there, yeah. I thought, thought we looked, but maybe not good enough. Oh, yeah, and also, like, okay, so the gravity... The meteorite staff makes rock sling better. Um, yeah. But the other staff... The Academy Glintstone has higher scaling and makes other spells better. So as long as Rock Sling is what I'm my goal, then it's like, yeah, it's it's good for that. But this is this is here. And now we can do this. But uh, if I'm not mistaken, um Oh no wait, this one didn't have a trade-off. Boost Castile Accessories. Uh oh, is it this one? Yes, consumes additional FP. Right. All oh, for faster sorceries? Yeah, 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 yeah. This was what it was. Uh, so what do you do to my scaling? Um, if I just... Sorry, put these side by side. Because now that I actually have the 52 intelligence... Uh, to, s to wield it... 233 versus 155 scaling. Because it's B versus S. So... Still not better, oh. um, but the effect of faster casting, I'm sure, has its uses. Um, okay, and let's see if, if I could upgrade this to see what it is. Uh, okay, so I'll keep that in mind because, um, like this, could meteorite doesn't get upgraded. Okay, uh, but if That's I can, fixed. if I if I can upgrade Azur, then we can see how that looks. And now to find that damn access point. Hmm. Okay, so you're set up here. This is a corner. This is a, a wall. This room seems to have no pathways up. Yeah, no. So yeah, not from there. Message. Okay. This waterfall. Oh, could it be here and then going this way? Okay. Yeah, let's try that. Uh, so from here and try to follow this body of water to stay above. Yeah, let's go check it out then. Because we've been going around in circle that. Of the area, area, and not finding anything. It's, it's a little, uh, it's, it's a bit of a maze, isn't yeah. it? All right, let's do this. Right. All right. So now you're forcing me to go right down the stairs, but if I want to go left, this gets blocked off, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Okay. So that means the elevator is actually where we want to be. I wish I could put the staff on my back. Like, it, I, I know how, you know how it's kind of like in like sword yeah. resting position. I wish I could have it like straight on A my cross. back. Or across, even. Yeah, but either one, you know? I think that would uh, that'd be cool for idle staff position. Customization ideas. Mm -hmm. 
now we're going deeper. All right, so from here, I want to go upwards to the right a little bit. We're going to be in this area and follow the water instead of the land. Please lead us somewhere. Looks like it does. Yeah. Magnifique. Excellent. Perfect. Where will this lead us? To the top of the waterfall in that yeah. um, rock room. Seek left. And there's and an item right across. over there. Yeah. Yeah, I, I remember now. Mm -hmm. There were stones, one and two everywhere. Okay. Up there. Over there. Down here. Not that the rocks hurt that much anymore, yeah. but... That's the drop. Road. Huh. Whoa. Stone three. Aha. Oh, you're done. You're done, you motherfucker. Stupid rock slinging. Ow, ow. <laughs> Oh, God damn it. God damn it. <laughs> the lock on. Watch your step. All right, just snipe him. Watch your step, step. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. All right, just snipe, just, just snipe him, just snipe him. <laughs> uh, it's cool. We know how to get there now. <laughs> we just have to do the job. Had to happen at some point. Still with the look, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking about thinking about things. Thinking about things. Hmm. Like for example, the hood that I have, this shot the scarf doesn't show when I'm wearing um a body set that whoa, look at you guys. Uh, yeah, when you have, like, a, a, a dominating, like, uh, shoulder to the, to the, to the shirt you're wearing. Yeah. Uh, it covers over the scarf. Sad. Oh, there it is. It's already laughing at you. Right, attempt number two. Wow. That was fast. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, almost seven K. Revenge. Praise the magic. Attacking. Here. Mm -hmm. What's here? <laughs> well. Oh, there. And that would lead you back down towards the grace. Yeah, if you if you Not needed it. Bad, yeah. So it's, that's a, that's a what 
You can't get up that way, but you no. can get down that so <laughs> that way safely. Time for ranged battle. Mm -hmm. I'll be the dis decider of that. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe this is a place to hide while you fight him. Yeah, I guess. If you yeah. get some arrows and yeah, stuff. Yeah, if you're you hanging out here, you can you the can. rocks. There you go. Okay. Nothing else. That seems to be it. Ooh. Um. Doesn't connect to anything else. So what's undiscovered is like this northern part. Uh, which would require following the river and then instead of taking um, the left, take the right. Is that a message up there? Cheeky fuckers. <laughs> Coming in from Just showing the, off. Or dropping from above, possibly. Yep, that's a bit of a... Looks like you can possibly even walk up there. Okay. So I'm assuming he's not going to respawn. Uh, but either way, we still have to take it back up here. Mm -hmm. Which means coming back over here, uh, going this way, and then instead of... Wait, yeah, go this way, and then see if we can go from here to there. Because we can't get back up there. Einzel. Kind of a fuck. Kind of a fuck. Light it up. I gotta say, like, I feel like at this point, Woolsworth would just be, like, coming off of a an endorphin high. Yeah. And just all the current kill monsters being killed are being done with like a complete joyless, monotonous face. <laughs> just punching things with no expression. Cause you're like, yo, that rush? That high? We'll never get that ever. That's again. it's gonna be a while. No, <laughs> it's gonna come. But it's gonna take a while. Take a bit. It'll take a while to hit those highs again. That's why you need to, like, space it out, you know? You space out the experience. Yeah, no, Woolsworth, <laughs> she's, uh... She's just kind of going through the motions, you know? It's like coming back from a vacation. Yeah! And you're like, oh... What, yeah, yeah, yeah. What am I doing here? It's, oh... All this fun and excitement. Alright, so were you going to let us take that road? And they're gone for good, so that's nice. Hmm, doesn't look like it. Yeah, still doesn't lead us up here. What if we... No, it's, it's all closed off, isn't it? Okay. Let's get a better look from above. Okay. Up there and up there. So this brings us back. And instead of floor. and instead of dropping off, is there a way to get higher? No. There isn't. Boy. Alright. Huh. So how does it connect? I'm really not sure. This is a dead end with the with the waterfall. Yeah. Um this is all walled off. And then this is elevated. And then this is closed. And then this room was also closed. 
and this was walled off, and then this was walled off, and then this was all death drop. So, unless there's another... I, I It's possible that it could be like, um, like, uh, Siofra, uh, Shafra, mm -hmm. where, you know, this was, this was Kaelid, and this was Lyurnia, or a Limgrave, rather. It could be one of those things where there's, like, two points, but, uh, if so, then... Like, you know what I mean? It could be, like, divided in two, and then it's, like, come at it from above in another location. Um, and if that's the case, then we've done the extent of what we can do here for now until we find the next elevator. Um, if that's not the case, then uh, I don't want to waste too much time if this is all closed off. Mm. So looking around... We did look at the map and figure out that it led us towards this place. But now this is further closed. Uh, if I drop down here again, we're committed. We looked along the right side. Um, And then the only other question is like, you know, the game of invisible walls and no. bullshit. Invisible floors and bullshit, but uh, I'm guessing it's a more conventional solution in this situation that I'm just uh, gonna need to find. I hope the messages can help out in that regard. Otherwise, we're gonna be wasting burning daylight, so to yeah. speak. I'm uh, not sure what's the, what the deal is with this area. Maybe. If we come back through here, this is, I want to say, where the um, the bugs were. And... Did, guess? did we Did we go all the way to the end of the ant room? I and don't yeah, know. Yeah, we, we, we did, and we hit a pit, right? Didn't we hit, like, a... a, a, a like a... Nothing but, like, scarlet rot kind oh, of... Oh. Like, looking over the we came. Yeah, we came okay. to a precipice of scarlet rot. Um... Which I still have a bunch of questions about, actually. Why is it here? Um, well, no, more like... Um, uh, 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 shit, what was it? There was an item description that got me thinking about um, uh, Millennia. Um, but uh, I'll back to that in a second. We're kind of... We're kind of stuck here. Mm. <sighs> okay. I don't know. Should I just fucking leave? Am I wasting yeah, time? I guess I I don't see what else. I feel like I'm just wasting time. Uh, let's let's see if this here was it was not what I thought it was. Right down there. Try here. Leads us to the grace. And then we sneak around, and then we go that way. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. Do you feel like moving on? It's a bit frustrating, because I literally... Uh, I don't know. Um, I'd rather clear this out to the extent as that I can possible. before continuing onward, since, like... Everything about like this is a this is a lower level area, you know. So, um, okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep scraping a little bit. Okay, trying to find that path if it connects. And, then and it's it's entirely it possible we're super done. You just can't know until yeah, you. you don't know what. <laughs> know that whether or not you missed the thing. Like, oh, look here, yeah. there's a hole with a cave. Like, we don't yeah, know. so the last place of uncertainty. Was like. This little section over here. 
And then, uh, let me just make sure that little indentation is nothing. And then we'll leave. Because this indentation is in the direction of, like, letting us get to the top area, but... Yeah, okay, right, so this was where we got and saw that message and it was nothing. Okay, fuck this, let's go. Okay. Yeah, we, we've, we've been around, huh? I, I did the best you. I could. Yeah. I can't, I can't find anything else. And, and I'm starting to feel crazy. <laughs> like, I'm let's like, ah. Out. Let's get out. Okay. So, uh, that's two of the, uh, three of the underground done. Oh my god. Um, we'll be back for fucking <laughs> scary zone. Um. <laughs> we'll be back for the terror that is there over there. Uh, what was there? Oh! Uh, yeah, there was Volcano Town, uh, there was the, uh, Gelmir Hero's Grave, and then there was Altus. Ooh. Right? Grave? It's time? If it's just like the, the other one, it should be a fun one. Should be. Or was it the uh, French Folk? French Folk Heroes. Yeah. Um, and then, of course, there's the proper, um... Continuing across the plateau. So. Our friend, Moog, left us some gifts. He left us some gifts, one of which was Moog's great rune, devoid of any benediction. The great rune of the shard bearer Moog, devoid of any benediction. Seek the divine tower of East Altus, which stands beyond the great bridge from Lanedale's eastern ward. We need to reach the capital and cross it. We talked about when we saw the meteor as the next point of interest and that we were going to save that for afterwards, right? Uh-huh. Okay. I'm just making sure we remember yeah, that yeah, conversation. Yeah. Um, the Divine Tower of East Altus is what we need to activate this. Okay. Another one. Um, fingers. Hmm. What would that do once activated? Also, what part of the logo is, is that? What part of the Elden Ring yeah. is this circle and line in it? Uh, and then there was... What else was there? Oh, we're coming for you. We're coming for you. 60. Soon. Um, the Remembrance? Yep. That would be on the main page. Oh, take the power of his namesake via finger reader. Remembrance of Mog, Lord of Blood, hewn into the Earth Tree. The power of its namesake can be unlocked by the finger reader. Alternatively, it can be used to gain a great bounty of runes. Wishing to raise Michaela to full godhood, Mog wished to become his consort, taking the role of monarch. But no matter how much of his bloody bedchamber he tried to share, he received no response from the young MP. Oh, simp! <laughs> oh my gosh. It's non-reciprocal. It is one way. Big simp. Nikella is uninterested. Oh no. Ah, damn. Yo. The real Einzel is over here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, dude. No love for you. Was Moog about to go his own way? No, no, he was still in there. Well. Still subbed. Yeah, we tier four. Tier four. Committed. We put down a tier four sub, dude. <laughs> oh, no. Do you see me? <laughs> Okay. No answer from Michaela. Yeah. Too many messages in the chat, you know? <laughs> yeah. Now, I, I heard some weird things that I don't have context for, so I'm just going to pretend I didn't hear them until I get context. And we'll leave it at that. Mm -hmm. But, uh, as of now, Michaela said nah. Nah. <laughs> 
All right. All okay. right. Kill them. Hard. So we can cash this in for some items. Uh, actually, let's go find out about those. Yay. Let's see a finger. What do you mean can't travel? I'm in a cave. I'm in a oh. cave. Fine. The beast eye quivers. Yeah, I wonder how Garank is doing. Oh, his stomach cramps. Don't want you to get really hungry. Yeah, well, he can wait. <laughs> he's a fucking... He's not, he's not very grateful. You know? And nothing turns me off than... More than... You know, going out of your way for somebody and they don't even acknowledge it. I don't like that. That bothers me. It's not why you do it, but... It just rubs me the wrong mm. way. So he can chill. It's a bit dark in here. A little bit. Okay. God, I care so much about fashion. <laughs> like, like, Every time you're on the elevator, you're thinking about it. Yeah, I really do. I really do. I guess you gotta do something about so it. So the proper... Get the good gear. The proper helmet that's supposed to go with this is um, is the is the fire monk hood. But um, I really like the banished knight helm. So yeah. Okay. Whatever. It's fine. Mm-hmm. Damn, son. <laughs> you're not sure. You're thinking about it. You're like, ah, oh, take it off. Nah, that's nah, good. Nah, I'm, I'm, oh, I I'm, I'm, I acknowledge, I acknowledge the importance and my, and my, the significance of these robes to my heart for that situation. But. Uh, it's like Friday night and you're like looking at yourself in the mirror. You're like I, this suit or this I suit. I care. Can't choose. Going out Saturday night too. <laughs> I, I care. I care. I really got two do. nights in a row if we need to. I really, really care. Everybody's gonna what see a me bop. good. What a bop. Okay, we're outside. Let's go home. <laughs> All right, fingers. Check this out. The fingers want you to smell them. <sighs> you have returned. What is it? So what do we got? His spear. Sacred spear. Arcane. Arcane of 27. Of course. Blood loss builder. And fire. Uh-huh. Physical and fire, yeah, that's good. A trident of Moog, Lord of Blood, a sacred spear that will come to symbolize his dynasty. As well as serving as a weapon, it is an in instrument of communion with an outer god who bestows power upon accursed blood. The yeah. of truth desires a wound. The, it's it's fire and it's blood blood flame. What was the other one? Cold lightning? Yeah, <laughs> ice lightning. <laughs> ice lightning and blood flame. <laughs> blood boon ritual. Raise a sacred spear and pierce the blood body boom. of the formless mother. Stab up to three times, creating explosions of blood with each thrust. This skill will coat the armament with blood flame for a while. Oh my god. <laughs> blood flame. <laughs> a song of ice lightning and blood flame. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. A little bit. Okay. Uh... And that is actually, like, humble requirements for a boss weapon. And then Blood Boon itself. Ah, here we go. Scatters Blood Flame before caster to set area aflame. That shit was annoying. Faith and Arcane. Sacred Incantation of Mo, Lord of Blood. Thrust arm into the body of the Formless Mother, then scatter the Blood Flame to set the area ablaze. Can be cast while in motion. The Mother of Truth craves wounds. When Moog stood before her, mm. deep underground, his accursed blood erupted with fire, and he was besotted with a defilement that he was born into. Ah, 
the mother of truth. The formless mother of he, truth. He stood before her and then became what he became. Interesting. Yeah. Pierce the body of the formless mother. Nihil. Nihil. <laughs> Nihil. Okay. Okay. Interesting. Man, that's cool if you've got a an arcane build. That seems fun. Yeah, you got a few cool things. Yeah. Um, um, not as many as Faith, but you know. 50 and 60, right? No, 60 and 70. Yeah, there you go. And? Oh, no set. Okay. Oh. Oh, wait. So we have to agree. Wait, wait, wait. 20,000 for the robe. Never mind. Oh, it's right there. Okay. Just, just the robe. Expensive. It's just the robe. It was a pretty badass robe. I mean, he was otherwise just like a demon man, right? Underneath it with the horns and stuff. Uh, yeah, it's a big, big fancy robe, certainly. Attire of Moog, Lord of Blood, embroidered with an extravagant gold emblem on black cloth. Mm. The dress of a luminary, the reigning lord and hierarch of the coming dynasty of Mogwin. Or, or perhaps, perhaps a, a raving, raving lunatic. lunatic. <laughs> My lambkin. Damn. Damn. A raving simp. Bodied by the lore. <laughs> Exposed. Mm -mm. You were cool until your clothes started talking. Hey, we look cool. All right. Do you have 20k in your pocket? I don't. Well, I might. I, I think I do, actually. Hey, how much bussy oh, is Mo gonna fuck. get? Nihil! <laughs> Nihil! <laughs> Nihil! <laughs> oh, man. He's so sad. Not even a drop! <laughs> Not a crumb! <laughs> yeah. Uh, tres? Nah. -uh. Duo? Nah. -uh. Udos? Udos? Nihil, <laughs> 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 Moog. Nihil. <laughs> Aww. Yeah. Alright. Uh, 20k, right? Yeah, you need like 13 more. Now the shop can do this for us. Well, I took you for dinner, man. To lay out your arms. Mm -hmm. Give me the money. Uh, okay, twelve, fifty. Ooh. Ooh. That's pretty substantial. Ooh. We got a level. Level in the pockets. Thank God the mug bears aren't real mug bears. Yeah. Um. All right, sixteen. Uh, two. Three point two. Three point six. Uh, four point six. Five point four. Not enough. But then we can sell some flowers. And you chill. Yep. You sit right there in the pocket. Sh should I put it in the chest? Just in case. Just in case you mess up? Just in case I make a mistake. What are you scared? Uh, one button press is, is reasonable to be afraid of. Especially if you're not paying attention properly. Uh, as long as you don't forget about it. Yeah. Arturia leaves. No, you won't forget about it. You got your moon veil alarm ringing. <laughs> <you> <laughs> <laughs> Damn, straight to the leaves, huh? 
I mean, to be honest, I can just do another ride around and pick berries between sessions mm -hmm. sometime. <sighs> Give me the robe. Enya. Enyaba. Yeah. All right, let's take a look. How's it look? When you jump on the table and like dust flies up, fucking, it's like I don't remember that seeing that table dust in Volcano Manor. Do you? <laughs> Just saying. You eat on this table. Oh. When they're not on a demon god, you can actually see the similarity between them and the queens. Like, yeah. All right. Looks like he, you know, like if I had to just take a guess based on the the um, the color schemes being similar, not in not in terms of cut, but in terms of like they look like they come from the same football team yeah so like I'd be like oh he probably looked like someone that came from Raya Lucaria wearing his Raya Lucarian robes before becoming what he became but that's totally just random headcanon but it's just because of how similar these are the Raya Lucarians you know the blue and the red the trimmings everyone that's magic has that they're wearing those colors uh -huh. right blue and red are the colors of the Raya Lucarian people the magic um you take it up to the queen's robes, you see, you know, a fancy form of them, and then you take a look at his, and it, it, it's darker blue, but it also looks like he could come from Mariah Lucaria, you know? Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if, like, that were the case, before becoming a fucking blood god. Time will tell, yeah. Um, of course, if he's older than the Academy itself, then that doesn't make a ton of sense, but we don't know. He seems like some kind of otherworldly you know, being that could have come beforehand. The Lord of Blood. Yeah, yeah, you don't get a title like that without, you know, either being, like, ancient or fucking badass mm. in the present day. But, uh, yeah, I, I, it's the first thing that comes to mind when I, when I take a look at these robes and the trimmings on them. But they're pretty. They're cool. Um, they make your shoulders look big. Okay. So we got uh, some cool arcane weapons, mm -hmm. but still not suited for the build. Nope. So we're Forget gonna come. About it. We'll come back to that when we are um, when we're ready to buy our spells. Jarberg. What's going on in Jarberg? You want to see the tiny pot? Mm -hmm. And I had a theory. Let's go. Potentate. Oh. Hello again, cuz. I'm happy you came back. I have good tidings for you, cuz. Have you noticed the rare flowers growing in this village? I asked the villagers if you could pick some of them. And they said you'd be very welcome. Yay. That's cool. Go on, Kaz. You really should pick some of our flowers. Who knows? They might be of some use. Do you care about my helmet? Does it matter? It might not. Go on, Kaz. Who knows? Boo. Okay. Well, I, I did pick... I did pick some flowers. I didn't pick the ones that were being admired by everybody. I see. But uh, I've already done it. Just the unattended ones. Yeah. Seems oh, to be what Jar. A lot of different flowers. Yeah, this is what J Jarberg is basically just about grabbing these, grabbing these flowers when you come down here. Okay. Wow. Pot didn't lead to uh, any new discoveries. Fair enough. Uh, yeah. Right, okay, so... 
uh, what I was going to say was um, when we were reading about uh, shit, what item was it? Um, if you control F for uh, wait, well, you have, you have, it's, it's the notes, right? Yeah. It's not, like, descriptions or anything, so. If there's no lore in the item description, mm -hmm. then it might not be there. But what are you looking for? Um, I was gonna say look for, um, uh, Melania. Melania? Melania. Um, Melania the, like, Something there was a there was blade of Michaela. Not that that's the one we see often, but there was an item that had a different subtitle for her. Clean rot sword. No. Blade of um, Michaela. Michaela's lily signifies fate in the havoc tree. Ah, shit! You know, um, it's. I should have just taken a goddamn screenshot when I saw it. Uh, blah. An item you say that mentioned Malenia. Or. Or was it. No. Wing Sword Insignia obtained for knights who fought with Malenia the Severed. Thank you. Winged Sword Insignia. Uh, where's that? Um. Insignia. Is yeah, that, it should it, be a, a, a talisman that, that's a talisman. That's not a sword. Yes, it's a talisman. Fuck yeah. Okay. Um, I was trying to figure out what talismans to wear. Yeah. And and you saw that one. You were like, oh. Yeah. And and uh, I was looking. Yeah, it's one of these at the bottom. Yeah, this this row. Yes. Or not? <laughs> Where is it? Where is it? Aha! There we go. Talisman, talisman depicting a raised prosthetic blade, an honor bestowed upon the knights who fought alongside Malenia the Severed. Malenia the Severed. The wings symbolized Malenia and her undefeated prowess. Though she never knew relief from the accursed rot, rot she, she was, was born, born into, her, her blade, blade was forever, forever beautiful, beautiful and, and relentless. relentless. So she was born with rot. She used rot against Radon. Right? When uh, she was born into it, so yes. you think that she used it as well? Well, no. It they mentioned in Radon's weapons that Radon got fucked over by by Rot, right? When they fought to a standstill, yeah. And he survived it because he's just built different. If you remember, we talked about that, right? So he basically didn't. Everyone else dies and melts in Scarlet Rot. Radon's badass enough that yeah. it doesn't kill him, but he's now just a beast and fucked up by it. Um, and what's little of le is left of him is using gravity so that he can still ride his horse, right? Um, but this here, but like it's like Scarlet Rot is not just what she's using as like her weapon or her affliction of choice to, f to fight with. She's born with it, right? Um, and that's kind of interesting in the context that, like, uh, uh, whatchamacallit, um, Millicent was also just sitting there fucked up with Scarlet Rod as well, yeah. and it was coming from her, and we don't... And, and we saw Millicent in the swamp, right? We saw, she attacked us in the swamp. I rewatched the footage, and she had two arms and one blade. It's just that she was swinging. She was like swinging crazy. very fast, but yeah. when we saw her in the shack... Yeah. She was sitting down, she, but, and uh, no. When you saw she had one arm. Shack, yeah, yeah. So, so, so she had one arm, and I'm looking at Millennia the severed, and I'm wondering what was severed. That's exactly why I'm bringing this up, right? And then you have the fact that um, the dude. I hope they're not the same person. Took, I don't know, but there's definitely a connection there, right? And and you have the fact that the dude took uh, her in. Right, and was staying in the background yeah, and such. Yeah. But like he's not her father. 
You know what I mean? Like, he just is someone who trained her. But uh, that's exactly it. You're seeing the fact that they're similar in, you know, um, what's what the description of this thing is describing what we saw with Millicent. So when I saw that, I was yeah. like, are you describing the same person? Right? Yeah. Could be interesting. We'll have to see. But there's enough context clues here to maybe go that's either one thing or a connection I don't know and Millicent was playing with with rot yeah uh, she and she was yeah. the, she was being worshipped because yeah. of the rot coming from her yeah that sounds like the millennia being described in this item interesting right interesting I put two and two together on that and was like that could be something but we don't have enough to know for sure. I do hope that, like, you know, we kind of run into her later on and got a little bit more there. But, yeah, some of this shit now has context, depending on whether you remember it or not when you meet someone later on. So that's, that's, that's cool. I don't know. I thought it was interesting. That's really interesting. <laughs> right? Yeah, write that one down. See what we get. What the f- maybe. Maybe. Also, we gotta check in on Azur whenever time permits. So, so it would be another person that's just walking around with another name? Either someone doesn't isn't so either someone's either that's not her real identity or something else. Right? It could it's it could be something else or you know that would be crazy there's family there's bloodlines you know what i mean but the fact that it's like we've been looking at her name as millennia the blade of michaela yeah for the whole every time it popped up but in that one context one it was michaela the severed and, and they, mention, they mentioned a prosthetic sort as well severed and M- M- millicent has yeah. one arm and uh she's also a source of scarlet rot that's too coincidental that's all. Yeah. That did not fall upon deaf ears. Cool. I was just like, okay. And now another the, hero grave. The wool system is not completely worthless. <laughs> it's very good. It's very good. Oh boy. Oh yeah, we peaked, right? We peaked. Okay, you know what? Maybe fire resistance ain't that bad. <laughs> <laughs> the timing. Okay, so are we gonna get hit by a ball? No. A very aggressive skeleton. Surprise, motherfucker. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Yes, sir. I was wondering. <laughs> it looks like the type of path that requires it. I was like, where is it? Where's the ball? There's no rollers. Where's oh. the sound? Where's the sound of th- impending doom and threat? You know? Jeez. Yeah. Uh, anyway. All right. What is the situation with walking on lava? Because to be honest, uh, Torrent didn't like it. And that's about as far as we got. Oh, that's nothing. Okay, you're light, you're light. There we go. Where is it? There you go. They're coming back. They're gone. Let's just make sure both sides are... Ooh, that's fast. I can't believe that when you were in that other grave, you destroyed that thing, and you got an item out of it. With, the, forget, with the arching? The, the balls on top? Like, that was crazy. Let's look for some balls. Oh, it switched. 
Okay, so it's this game again. Yeah, all right. This is the new limit. Oh, and, and wow. It, and it's going to track, just okay. like last time. Yeah. yeah. All right, it, it follows you. Woo! I go crush <laughs> <laughs> That's two. Oh, the lava. The lava, actually. That's one. Is there something down there? There's a hole right there. Yeah. What? To? Quick step. <laughs> Isn't there a skeleton? It went over there? Okay. Good job, skeleton. There you go. Halfway point? Yeah, definitely halfway point. Nice. Grave Glove Word 7. New. Drop into Oblivion? Likely, but not 100% certain. Could be drop into content. Either way, this is progress. Uh-huh, and then another one coming that way. Oh! How you doing? Still sturdy. Page. Page garb, you got the gear. Nice. Let's check out our page set in a second. Extinguish its flame. Thank you, gardeners. Hello? Another page. Jump R2. Dunzo. Fire up there. Grave six. Damn. Below the stairs. Grave seven again. Ooh. Aristocrat hat. Okay. Okay, they're feeding. Where'd you come from? We can dress up like a little fancy lord. <laughs> my lord and my lady. Number seven. Would you like to be a page? Page garb, garb worn by pages who serve the nobility and are mindful to keep them out of arm's way. Traveling wear tailored with exquisite precision, precision to avoid any undue shame for the page's master. Then the hat, the leather hat decorated with a withered feather. Travel attire worn by nobles in the capital and be belonging to a family which claims a knight as an ancestor. Abandoning their birthplace after the shattering, these undead wanderers are the pitiful product of unending life. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And you can either look at them as abominations that need to be cleansed or people that need a hug. Needs to be saved. And would you believe that the huggers are the aggressors? <laughs> Could have fooled me. I've been fooled. <laughs> Shit. Look at me. Not bad. And I get that feeling of deja vu. All right. Let's put that on. Back to the good stuff. Yeah. Are you hot? Like outside of this level? Like actually? Oh. I'm a little bit hot. I'm, I'm comfy. I'm okay, comfy. I'm gonna turn the AC on. I feel cool. it's a little bit warm in here. One second, folks. <laughs> 